The power of music. Tonight, an inspiring group of singers is showing the importance of music and its ability to heal and empower. Sammy Solina introduces you to one couple using songs to bring back memories and make new ones. That looks really interesting. Salt Lake City. Pictures are handy. That's really pretty. Mm -hmm. For jogging the memory. I think we were close to that, weren't we? Because for Denise and Butch Tendall. We've been to Ephesus. They've been to more places than they can count. Oh, we were traveling everywhere. <laughs> yeah, we really love each other a lot. They've been married for 43 years. <laughs> and while their love hasn't faded. Look at that handsome guy. <laughs> memories have. <laughs> we have mild cognitive impairment is what they what they say and I'd say, well, what does that mean? I'm lose, losing pieces of my best friend every day. Do we ever go there? Butch has Alzheimer's. Uh, no, but does it look familiar? That's in Finland. He struggled with it for years. Finland. And while vacations have paused, voice they still have an escape. Music is love. For the past year, Butch and Denise have been part of Giving Voice Chorus. Giving Voice to our soul. Giving Voice is about creating choirs across the country uh, to celebrate what's possible while living with dementia or Alzheimer's. One, two, and. Everyone here has the disease or is touched by it. Eileen Cardwell is Butch's singing partner. You guys did. She started volunteering after her partner died from complications of the disease and has seen a transformation in Butch. He laughs. We tell jokes. We tease each other sometimes. I love to dance. He and Denise are grateful to be one of five Twin City choirs coming together for the biggest performance in its 10-year history at Orchestra Hall next month. Yeah, this was the last time they're all together before we hit that big stage. <laughs> Denise says she should have joined the choir years ago with her dad. Butch was diagnosed with mild cognitive impairment when I was still caring for my dad. I couldn't believe it. Her father died after his own battle with Alzheimer's. This is such an isolating disease. She says there are bad days, but those change when they arrive here. We both just love it. It's the people, it's the music, it's a chance to just feel normal in this environment. Mexico. India. You've been to India. More memories to make after so many wonderful trips together. Like all the rest, they'll travel it with one another. We're pretty young. Sammy Solina. Yeah, I can remember that lady, but you know what? Carol Evan News. She didn't pay her bill, though, did she? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding.